How's it going everybody? This is Bart Bigger Spaceball and I'm back with another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to like and subscribe for two to three MLB and innings videos per week. Today we have a decent amount of packs. We got 31 premiums. Not as many ultimate packs or gold packs as last time. But I think we're still in line for a pretty good video. Before I open packs for this team, I'm going to quickly show you guys my Royals team. I'm going to be using a few minor and intermediate GIs on some Royals players I have pulled over the last few days. Before we use those GIs, I also have the Light Season Diamond Pack I got as a guide mission reward to open. So let's see who we got. It'd be crazy if we got a Kansas City player, but I doubt it. We get Faria, Jake Faria, yeah, from the Brewers. Hopefully I'm going to add him to the lineup just because I'm going for a team set deck and he's not an overwhelmingly great player. Now know. let us move on to those minor and intermediate grade increase tickets. These minor GIs are really helpful. They're only 150 in the rank shot. So I pulled a better Danny Duff than the one I had. I'm going to use that on him. Well, if we get a decent GI, we got a 30, so that's the max, so that's pretty solid. Let's use another one on the Santana. I also pulled him as a league reward for winning a game. Another 30, that's crazy. He's a 70 base. I believe the Duffy's also 70 base. Let's use another one. Have this Herrera in our bullpen. It's pretty solid. 64 base. I don't believe we got a perfect GI on him. 21, so that's on the lower side. It's still alright. Alrighty, so let's quickly use this intermediate GI on that Duffy. Now that he's trained and upgraded, he will be my top Royals pitcher at the moment. Go oh, for a good GI. I think that's solid. 48, so that's good, yeah. And I'll go back to my Miami team for the pack opener. Let's check our combos real quick. I believe I pulled a Yomer Sanchez out of the intermediates. He's currently my new second baseman in rank just because he has charisma and batting machine. But he hasn't been performing very well. I also got this Grinky. Why not upgrade him? Even though it fails, not a big deal. Alrighty, and let's get started off with some combos. Alright, let's sort by lowest grade first. Got a decent number of silver combos. Today I was thinking of using the silver side pull from the silver packs as special training material. I guess that's the main way I can improve my team at this point. As you guys can see now, these silver combos aren't working out too well. And even if we get a combo, it's most likely going to be a gold. So I feel like it would be more beneficial for the development of my team to go with special training with the silvers so let me know down in the comments how you feel about that alrighty so let's get into some these silver packs hoping for some upgrade material maybe a primer vintage somewhere okay we got a uh, Sierra I think it's Magurnius Magnieris Never figure out how to pronounce his name. And let's quickly special train those away. The player I'm focusing on special training at the moment is this Anderson, who has endgame skills on him. I'm sure I can use that Mathis as an upgrade for the Mathis on my bench. But yeah, they got them to level 4. I'm probably just going to train, probably going to special train him to level 6, I think, so I can get the blue skills, level 7 skills, but yeah, 
Should be a good line, good addition to my lineup once he has all his skills have been upgraded. So let's open these next 10. Not seeing anything there. That's all right. Let's open this last silver pack. See who we get. And Carson Kelly? Yep. Please with the D backs now. Alrighty, so let's quickly do some more special training in Anderson. There we go. Alrighty. Yeah, I've been having a lot of fun with the Royals account as of late. And now just developing the team. It's been pretty enjoyable. There it goes. Can't wait till quarantine's over. As I assume a lot of you guys feel too. Let's open these premium packs. Yeah, I'm just missing being able to see my friends play baseball, which is usually the highlight of my spring, but I'd rather be inside and safe than putting other people at risk, potentially. Got a Corey Dickerson. He's an interesting guy to watch. Got a nice swing. And let us get into some more special training. Alrighty. Let's throw in some more silvers. Should be solid. Got really good training on this Anderson. Another good thing is that you play right field and third base. Or any outfield position for that matter. And yeah, I can show you my rank stats real quick, but I could definitely use uh, another hitter in my lineup. Alright, so let's open up another 10 premium packs. Got three golds that time, so that's pretty solid. Got Alcantara that I'm going to hold on to. Just for potential upgrade material, 69 base, that's pretty solid. Let's quickly do some special training. And we'll be right back. Some more packs. It is early in the morning when I'm recording this. So I'm assuming all you guys can hear the bird noises in the background. Hope you guys are enjoying them. The only bad thing about this is that it uses up a lot of my coins in the game. But thankfully I have a lot of letter tickets stockpiled up to prevent running out. Let's open up these last premium packs. One gold, so and that's not great, but I guess it's better than none, right? Let's open this last one and see how we do. And another silver, so that's pretty exciting. Okay, Michael A. Taylor. Here, let's quickly special train using those cards. Saving that math is for an upgrade. Getting up close to 25%, so that's pretty solid. And let's open those gold packs. Alrighty, so we got 10 golds, 2 ultimates. We'll be able to open the rest of our packs. Have enough room for that. 
see what we get here. Not surprisingly, all golds, because they're gold packs. Add some insightful commentary to these pack openings, like always. And let's open these two ultimate packs. And we get two golds. All right. All right, let's quickly upgrade those players. Looks like I hit a 99 OVR by upgrading, sorry, by special training. That's Anderson. We get this math, it's level 20. I believe he's only like 59, 58 overall. We're gonna save the upgrades for that oh, Contra. Just because he has like a 69, 70 base card and I'd rather save my material for him because I'm not going to put a 66 OVR in my lineup. Yeah, just be too significant of a downgrade to put that lower base Alcantara in my lineup in exchange for like a 72, 73 base like the Carrasco who's my fourth star at the moment. Pull the Jose Ramirez. Decent amount of combos, yeah. Let's do a three gold, one diamond to start off. Let's see how this one goes. Wow, that was nice. All golds, that's funny. <laughs> Keeps up like this, I'm gonna have to use all my cards for special training. Just kidding, I'm not going to, but that's still kind of irritating. Nice, we got three diamonds in here. Actually, I have the Sun I have Sano and Mathis. I believe for different years. But it'd be cool we pulled the Miami player. And we got the Wilson. Alright, so that's solid. Just kidding, it's not, but hey. At least we were able to see a uh, couple diamonds in that combo. Unlike the last one we did. We got two more in here. We got Franco and Adam Wainwright. And let's see if we pull anybody while it loads. And we get Franco. Nice. Let's check out his skills. Master base thief. Master base thief. So that's okay. It's another four gold. Two diamonds against so that solid. We got a Cole Calhoun in here. 67 base, which is solid. And we got a Jones, 61. If any of you guys are interested in what their base stats were, we pull the Aaron Nola. Let's do another four. That Zobris would be great for my Kansas City team. We got a Stewart. I believe it's. His name is kind of strange. It's like Kristen. Or it's like pronounced word. I'm not sure. And we get Elias. Let's throw in this Franco. Let's see what we get here. Alright, well, at least we see diamonds this time. Pretty solid cards in there. Barrios, Simeon, and Pinder. Lower OVR bases, but they're diamond cards nonetheless. Hold Archie Bradley. So let's do one more combo here. End off the video. Hopefully, we see something here. Alright, we got two diamonds. Freddie Freeman and Kevin Kiermeyer. And we got the Freddie Freeman, so that's solid. Checking out his skills 68 pace. Not great skills, but that's a solid card. Alrighty, so looks like that's gonna be it for the video. You guys can let me know down in the comments what you think about doing special training with the silvers. I mean, if you guys wanted me to special train once a week and combo them the other day, upload, maybe that could work too. But it looks like that's gonna be it for me. 
I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.